In this video, we'll balance the equation CH3NH2 plus O2. It gives us this carbon dioxide, water, and nitrogen gas. So let's count the atoms up and balance the equation. We have one carbon, and then hydrogens, we have three plus two. We have five. Make sure you count these two. One nitrogen, and then two oxygen atoms. Product side, we have one carbon, two hydrogens, two nitrogens, and then oxygens, we have two plus the one. That gives us three. So make sure you count those up correctly. With this type of reaction, leave the oxygen to last. That's because we can change the oxygen in the end and it won't affect the carbon, hydrogen, or nitrogen because it's all by itself. So we'll leave the oxygens to last. I think I will start by fixing the nitrogens. That's fairly easy. I have an odd number of hydrogens here. So I'll start with the nitrogens, put a two here, one times two, two carbons. For the hydrogens, I have two times three, Let's update the hydrogens here. So I have two times three, that's six, plus two times two, that's four. So I have 10 hydrogen atoms, two times one, that gives me the two nitrogens. That's what we were trying to balance. But that's good, this is now an even number. So we could fix the hydrogens by putting a five in front of the H2O. Now we have two times five, it gives me 10 hydrogen atoms, that's good. Let's update the oxygens. So we have two here, plus five times the one, five. Now I have seven oxygens. Let's next balance the carbons. Remember, we're leaving the oxygens for last. Put a two in front of the CO2, one times two, that'll give us two of those. So those are balanced. We update the oxygens again. Two times two is four, plus five times one, that's five. So we have nine. So we're left here now, we have two on this side, the reactants, nine on the products. So we wanna get this to nine. The way to do that is think two times something, that's gonna equal nine. So if I could put a coefficient here, get this to be nine, we'd be done. Two times nine over two, that would work. If I put nine over two as my coefficient, nine over two times two, twos cancel out, I have nine, we're done. This equation is balanced. This is the correct ratios, the correct coefficients for each substance. Some teachers, they don't like to have the fraction here, but that's easy to fix. If we take and multiply the whole thing, all the coefficients by two, two times two is four, two times nine over two, twos cancel out, we get nine, two times two again, four, two times the five is 10, two times the one, that's two. So these coefficients here are whole numbers. Either way, really either one of these answers is correct. When we balance equations, we're only interested in the ratios. That's what's useful to us as chemists, those ratios. So this is the balanced equation for CH3 and H2 plus O2. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.